You looking for this? <laughs> Welcome back to Boom Shot. I'm Kel. This is Colby yes, and Marvel Studios Ant-Man and the Wasp. We're a week out, by the way. And Let's go. We got a new TV spot. This is a team, t- team TV spot. Gosh, that's a tongue twister. <laughs> a lot of T's. Alliteration. Yeah, literally. A- anyway, but uh, before we jump into this, we're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers as fast as humanly possible. Um, we're going to go ahead. So if you like the content, subscribe. Blah, 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 blah. We're going to jump right into the starting now. In one week. I love the intro. It's time. Ooh, oh my. Avengers return. You're an Avenger. You're not the one with the hammer. That's Thor. We get confused a lot. It's It's good to see he has the humor still. I can't look so broccoli. I was just about to say that. Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. I literally saved the world. Thank you, Spider-Man. <laughs> get tickets now. I have to say, he's getting the rocket treatment. Yeah, he really is getting the rocket treatment. But I have to say, I think Ant Man has a better chance against uh, against Kang than than Spider Man does. No, I'm just kidding. I actually, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, Spider Man. Nobody, nobody has a good chance. Yeah, nobody has a good chance again. I mean, that's like saying like a, a ant has a good chance against a flamethrower. Like there's just <laughs> there's there, or a, a, a roach against a nuke. Well, apparently they're able to survive. But anyway. <laughs> I mean, yeah, hopefully our boy will survive in I mean, this. Um, huh? I mean, speaking of nukes, like, Tank... Uh, tank yeah. Kane can literally tank a nuke. Yeah, so. that is true. I don't I don't know if our, if our man's going to make it out. Yeah. Uh, that was a good TV spot. I like it. Was. It was. Uh, it had some humor in it. It, it gave us a little yeah. bit of, of new shots. Um, I was going to say something. And Dude, just, so was I. <laughs> and it literally just escaped my brain. It's good It's good to see Scott still has the humor, even though he, he's... Seems to be uh, heading towards an impending doom. <laughs> yeah, it it, lo- it it might be grim for Scott by the end of this movie. Which I have to say, like, if Kang's the one who kills him, I'd consider that an honorable death. <laughs> yeah, that's a good way to go out. <laughs> you know, I, I, that's what I was gonna say. I, if you could go back through all of our TV spots for for Ant Man and the Wasp: Quantum Mania and count how many times we said Kang, I bet it's in the thousands. <laughs> Yeah, you, you. It's like you. You know when you have a crush on somebody and you just love to say their name. Well, you. I mean, you're, you're married, but like, <laughs> you. You remember back in the day, you just like say their name. It's like that's how I feel with Kang, dude. I just constantly. Kang. 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 We started the Kang gang too, dude. Dude, what was I gonna say? Uh, what? 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 Uh, broccoli head. Oh yeah, broccoli head. I like how they did kind of like a with Ant Man. Yeah, that was cool. with Kang the Conqueror, in one week. Oh, when when uh. He, he, I said the rocket treatment because he got confused for Thor and then Spider Man. Yeah. <laughs> within thirty seconds, dude. Are you a rabbit? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Um, that's there, I mean, there wasn't like a lot new in this in this TV spot. Obviously, uh, it's Kang. So like that's that's pretty much why I, I, I settle on things. Yeah. Kang. That scene that scene where he's talking to Kang that was pretty funny. He's like, yeah. yeah, we have similar body types. Are you the one with the <laughs> the hammer? <laughs> No, <laughs> we're built kind of the same. I can see we're mistaken. Dude, do you even think Thor had a chance? Has a chance against Kang? Nah. Prime Thor from Infinity War? Nah. I don't even think Thanos with the gauntlet does, which, I mean, I guess Thor killed him. When but... you really think about it, Thanos with the gauntlet was just a pawn in King's plan. Yeah. Which is, uh, in, in He Who Remains' plan, anyway. Which I think was, like, kind of what blew our mind uh, in the first part of, like, Loki, like, our first video. We were like, bruh, Kang is Kang's the ringleader, dude. He's been he's been in charge of it the entire time, which is crazy to think about. Yeah, I mean, I guess the only person that has stopped this Kang is he who remains. Yeah, really. And if that if that's what if what we're speculating is true. Yeah, and the only person to stop he who remains is Sylvie. So Str- Sylvie's greater than char- Sylvie, <laughs> Sylvie greater than Kang, you know. <laughs> Uh, no, there's no way. And, and he who remains wanted to die. And then yeah, the, the, one of the most savage moments, he was like, see you soon. I was yeah, like, that, dang. That was sick. Dang. Yeah, that's how you know. It's funny because he wasn't even afraid to die. He was like, uh, I'll be back. <laughs> I'll get back here somehow. Dude, honestly, if the Marvel Universe ends and Kang's at the top, I'm okay with it. <laughs> yeah, it's just, it just turns into like villains every yeah, movie. Dude, Kang versus Kang. Kang wars, dude. <laughs> I would be down to watch that. that. Anyway. Sick. That we're we're adding to our King stats. If if you guys, if any dedicated fan wants to go back and check how many times we said King, I'd genuinely appreciate that. But uh, you got any last thoughts? Uh, one week away, dude. Let's go. I'm hyped. Yep, one week away. We'll we'll be covering the uh, movie, so be on the lookout for our review. And thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Mm-hmm.